In a headline last week that read an old medicine grows new hair for pennies a day, a local doctor office started getting a lot of phone calls. They did, and they say that both men and women are asking for the prescription. So medical reporter Meg Ferris wanted to find out if it works. At 22, Braden Brignac is starting his career in the financial industry, so casual clothes and a baseball cap to cover his balding head are no longer daily dress code. And people would make comments and jokes, and you're a 19-year-old bald kid. So stuff like that is just a little bit detrimental to your confidence. Dermatologist and hair restoration specialist Dr. Nicole Rogers started Braden a year ago on finasteride. It's a male hormone blocker, but can take three to five years to see significant regrowth. So earlier this year, she started him on oral minoxidil. That's when it started blowing up. It like looked great in comparison. Jokes changed to compliments. I'm like, oh my gosh, this looks awesome <laughs> because of how different it was over just a few months span. You've heard of topical minoxidil under the brand name Rogaine. It's drops you put on your scalp. But the pill form has been around since 1979 for high blood pressure, and hair regrowth is a side effect. I have colleagues in places like Bangkok and around the world, they've been using oral minoxidil for decades. They never stopped using it. But here in the United States and North America, we've just sort of come back to the idea of using it as an oral medicine. It's prescribed off-label, meaning the FDA has only approved it as a blood pressure medication. So people with heart conditions need their cardiologist's approval. But it's very low dose, brings more blood and nutrients to the hair follicle. It's for men and women, and there are no hormonal effects. And side effects with the pill are rare. I always describe minoxidil as a fountain of youth for your follicles. It's getting better absorbed. And I also think patients are more consistent with it when they have the option of taking it in a pill form rather than trying to slather it all over their head. Well, next thing I'm like, I don't have to wear hats anymore. I can just look great. And the best part, it's very inexpensive. Braden pays $27 for a three-month supply, and another person said this month-and-a-half supply only cost her around $3.5. Meg Farris, Eyewitness News, Medical Watch.